When and where was the first time you met Janelle? First time I met Janelle was at the Blue Gator. Blue Gator? Yeah, was it? You want to elaborate on that? Is the next question about elaboration? <laughs> <laughs> where was your first date? Ugh. Our first official date? Yeah. Honestly, I think it might be at the cabin. Question, question, with, mark, question with, mark. With other people, but I think the first time I ever texted her one on one to come and hang out, well, not one on one, there were people there, but I think it was at the cabin. All right. <laughs> what was Janelle wearing? Oh, gosh. Oh, I remember what she was wearing. She was wearing a gray top, kind of flowy, short, no long sleeve, it was winter. Okay. And she had a red, one of those scarf things that, you know, you, double, you double wrap. And uh, yeah, it was, it was a gray shirt and a double wrapped little red scarf around the top. She, she looked beautiful. Wow. That just, that just makes my heart melt. <laughs> <laughs> Where did your first kiss take place? Our first kiss took place in a cab on the way home from the Gator. The first night that we ever met. Wow, that's special. That's a special moment. It was. It was. It was really special. All right. Rachel Tracy was there. So what is Janelle's idea of a perfect date? Oh, Janelle's idea of a perfect date involves some good food. First of all, we love Asian food, but she loves Mexican. So hey, me too. Me too. So if it's Janelle's perfect date, it's gonna be a Mexican restaurant. We're gonna get a couple margaritas, and then we're gonna go back home, and we're gonna cuddle, and we're gonna watch a movie. Right. What is your idea of a perfect date? What is my idea of a perfect date? Well, my perfect date would have to involve Asian food, <laughs> probably hibachi. It's like a kid, dude. Like Asian food or so Asian food and then probably after I mean some some sake some sake Asian dinner and then go back home and just chill yeah. Spend yeah. time together quality time together Who said I love you first? When was it and where were you? I said I love you first Wow, I didn't, I was, I didn't expect that. I was laying in my bed in uh, my my first downtown apartment in Mount Pleasant, okay. and she was in Chicago or was just about to move, and I didn't want to lose her, so I wanted to seal the deal, and I really was in love. And it's real stuff, man. So that's that's. And where were you? In my bed, in Mount Pleasant. In your bed. Texting, just laying in bed. What is your pet name for Janelle? Nelson. Or Nelly. What is her or pet, what is her pet name for you? Gosh, oh, she, she doesn't really have one. You don't, you don't name, she doesn't have any name for you at all. Mm -mm. I'm trying to think. James, probably just James. <laughs> what do you find most sexy about Janelle? Besides everything, it's got to be her eyes. Why is that? I will never forget the very first time she and I ever hooked up. I woke up the next day, I looked her in the eyes, and I was just like, she's a babe. It's the best I'm going to ever get. Wow. Well, what did she find most infatuating about you? Define infatuating. No, I know what that means. Like, but like what she's like most into about. Like the first time we met, or just in general. I think Janelle likes that I'm unpredictable. Ooh. I think so she likes the. Ladies, she has a good side and a bad side. <laughs> Primarily a good side. What is the best gift you ever received from Janelle? Wow, she's got me some awesome gifts. Um. I'd say the best gift that Janelle has gotten me. I think it's this year's Christmas. She gave me a piano. Now I love piano. I, lo I love serenading my babe. Hey. What is Janelle's favorite TV show? 
her favorite TV show. Oh God. She loves, well, recently she loves This Is Us, but I think her favorite show of all time is Grey's Anatomy. Okay. I'm also a fan. <laughs> what is your favorite TV show? I like lots of shows. Right now, I think I gotta go with Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones, great show. What is Janelle's favorite food? Janelle's favorite food? If it's a style, Mexican. Okay. If it's an actual food, avocado. Big Mexican guy, like Latina girls. And what, <laughs> what is your favorite food? What is my favorite food? Popcorn. Dude, <laughs> can I just be honest for a second? Living with this guy for about a year and a half now. Love him, he's great. This guy eats a bag of popcorn every single night. Imagine his teeth in 10 years. <laughs> what toppings does Janelle get on her pizza? Janelle, if she's gonna get a pizza, it's gonna be salad cheese. Even yeah. the pepperoni kinda weirds her out. Definitely not meat lover. She's not a fan of that. She doesn't know where it came from. She likes cheese. Well, what is Janelle's favorite pizza place? Janelle's favorite pizza place is Hungry Howie's. What kind of crust? Butter cheese. What is Janelle's weirdest habit? God, Janelle's weirdest habit. All right, well, she's like partially unconscious. Okay. But when she's falling asleep, she twitches. So you just like stare at her when, you, when she's sleeping? Oh, I, I like, Janelle, are you asleep? And she's just... <laughs> Just twitching, but she's not asleep yet. So but it's, like, it's, it's like a cute twitch. It's oh, like, it's adorable. It's okay. like, oh, okay. God, it's so cute. Uh, what is your weirdest habit? <laughs> what is my weirdest habit? Oh, uh, I'm a weird guy. We know. <laughs> my weirdest habit? Yeah. I think my weirdest habit is I sing over the artist that sing that what you know I listen to in the car when we're driving. I can see that. I, can see I, that. I think I sing way too much. I yeah. think that's a weird habit of mine. What is Janelle's alcoholic drink of choice? Janelle likes margaritas and martinis. Her margarita has got to have extra salt around the rim, okay. and her martinis got to be extra dirty. Okay, so define dirty. Like extra olive. Extra olive. What is your alcoholic drink of choice? Moscow Mule. That's true. I can vouch for that. What is Janelle's celebrity crush? Janelle's celebrity crush has got to be Ryan Gosling. Ryan Gosling? Mm hmm What is your celebrity crush? My celebrity crush would have to be Jessica Alba. Wow. <laughs> Where is your favorite place to vacation as a couple? Definitely Cocoa Beach. Cocoa Beach, Florida. How many children do you plan to have? How many children? I think, <laughs> I think three, you know? At least two, one boy, one girl. If you ever put in the dog house, what would you do to get out? If I'm put in the doghouse, I think what I gotta do is just drop my pride and just do the next right thing. Just <laughs> I think that makes sense. Just be nice. Yeah. Just be nice. Yeah. yeah. What is something most people wouldn't know about Janelle? She will disagree, but I think most people don't know that she has a good voice. She sings, and every time I'm like, babe, you could like be in a band. She's like, no, no. Wow. She has a good Look voice. At, at what point did you know you wanted to marry Janelle? Wow, we're about to get emotional. Wow, we're getting deep. <laughs> I knew that I wanted to marry her before I went to New Zealand. Um, that was a year ago from this past Christmas, almost two years ago. When you have the best girl that you're ever going to get, and you realize that, you're like, I'm marrying up. You then kind of got to make the decision because you know, a day or a week later, you could you could mess something up and she could be gone. What had been your most enjoyable memory with Janelle up until now? Oh, 
I'd have to say Africa. Yeah. I'd have to say Africa. I'd have to say this. Actually, that exact moment was probably the best moment we've ever had, for sure. What quality of Janelle is you admire most? I'd have to say her brain. <laughs> I love how thoughtful she is. She cares so much about me, about my day, about my career, about my passions. She, she cares about everybody so much and it just warms the heart. Wow. All right, so before the last question, I just want to cheers you both. I'm so happy for the both of you and I can't wait to be there on your guys' wedding day. And I hope you guys have a great time on your bachelorette party. I can't wait for you to lock this guy down. He's a lucky man and you're a special girl. Cheers. Cheers. Alright James, last and final question here. Do you have any last words for your beautiful wife-to-be before she heads out with the girls for one of her last single nights in the town? All I gotta say is I love you. Cheers to you. I cannot wait to be married to you in 19 days. And I hope the penis inflatable makes it to the bar. But I hope that you have a great night. I hope you take lots of tequila shots. I know you love that. I know Jane will be providing those. So have fun. Cheers to you girls. Brandon. I wish you guys the best. See you in 19 days.